So, um, so on this video, uh, it's, I don't think it's going to be a long one. Just to briefly to uh, explain uh, the differences between shock absorber and the stud. Because uh, we tend to uh, use them interchangeably. Myself, I also do that. So I think I don't know the difference. You know, just sometimes I'm like, you know, uh, such in Nigeria, uh, everybody uses that word, shock absorber. So trying to explain it, uh, trying to use uh, the word stuart is like confusing because they, I assume, or I believe most Nigerians wouldn't even know what I'm talking about. So sometimes I just use that word shock absorber, even though I know it's not actually shock absorber. Or at least that's not, it doesn't, the word, those two words, uh, they don't represent what I was trying to describe. Uh, so, um, so I'm going to do that here so that you know the difference. It's not just shock absorber, we have damper, shock absorber, stuart. Okay. So now what you are looking at here is um, shock absorber. This is actually the shock absorber. I also call it a damper, but damper doesn't necessarily mean more the shock absorber. Damper is just anything that will absorb shock. From the engine, from the boats, you know, preventing the shock, the vibration, call it vibration for, for getting into the or at least the body of the car for feeling all those vibrations. So, um, like what I mean by damper means even your uh, all this pushing, your engine mount, the gearbox mount, which, uh, this uh, suspension bushings and the here and there. They actually serve as dampers, but they are there to damp uh, to absorb this vibration of shocks, you know, uh, even for the world coming from the airports. At least, not completely, but at least reduce the shock for the vibration from the people. It can actually kind of uh, hurt it, very uh, like I said. Um, so, if all things be okay, so, uh, so the shock absorber can regard this as a uh, damp as well. So the shock absorber is the uh, uh, shock absorber is the one that you can see this one has no spring attached on it. So I mean the spring is independent of uh, the series. This is actually a uh, shock absorber for my five five. This is the real one. Um, I changed it. Uh, was it one? Was it? Was it not last year? Or early this year? Last year. So, um, I don't know if you haven't really failed this one. I've not actually failed on this So, I still get it. But this is chocolate. This is new one. So, uh, there are no springs attached to me. So, chocolate is the, um, uh, or the shot does not have spring attached. It's just a separate unit on its own. So, um, like for example, another car that you can find a uh, shock on the right is a 406. Uh, the rear shock on the left hand power shock on the right is a 406. Yeah, not wrong. Yes. Uh, those, yeah, those ones are regarded by shock on the right. If you don't have space at that, right? Why? 307. Uh, Yes, three or seven, yes. Yeah, three or seven, they don't have. What they have is chocolate. Well. Now, let me show you what the stroke is. Uh, let's start from here. So, this is for four. See, this is also the one I removed. Um, that should be for my own four horses. Yeah, this should, I think so. This is when I change my four horses chocolate. It's one for us. So, well, I call it for shock absorber again. So this is Stuart. S T R U T. This is Stuart. Each of these, this is a unit. This is Stuart. So the Stuart is made up of all the shock absorber, the spray, the uh, shock, uh, the, the mount, um, you know, uh, depending on the other things that could be there, depending on the design, but this is like the unit. So this is what. So you could say uh, this is shock absorber though, but it has to be without this. For example, let me show you what shock absorber is actually. Uh, what made up of uh, shock absorber? Hold on, guys. 
Oh, this is a perfect thing. I'm sorry, you understand this thing very well. So you can see how this thing is uh, dismantled. So you can actually call this shock of the door. Yes. But then it's actually a unit. Just a kind of dismantled it. Unlike uh, this one, the earlier one I showed you guys, this one doesn't work. It just mounted like this thread. No springs, it doesn't need to work. Well, the spring will be dependent on the so Why this? Um, for this to work, you have to pull back all these components on this thing. So you could call this damper or shock absorber, but as a unit, it becomes taut. So whenever you see, so let me show you an example of the one that is assembled. I mean this one now that has been assembled and uh, that have become that you can now look at and uh, look at them. This is exactly what uh that it is here. This is exactly no difference. So, but now it's a unit that you know they've been coupled or so you can regard this as taught as it is. This is uh for my four seven proof basis. You can see the um uh, uh what is it called? Uh electro valve attached on them. Uh, so but this is still a uh, strut as it is. Um so uh this is a uh, strut for the rear four seven. This one so you can see this is the for this is rear this is for the coupe, this is that's when I changed my so this is for the four cylinder uh four seven. So you can see there's no electronic control. You can see uh not uh connectors, wires attached on this one. So this one is the variable strut. This is the non-variable strut for four seven, the rear. Why this is for front? So four or seven, both the front and the rear, they all use strut because it's a there is just an assembly. Both the the mount, the <coughs> the spray, they're all together. So if you're buying it like what you're buying is strut, not the shock of well or the damper. You know, just can call it that they are part of it. Um so uh that's basically it. Um I wish I had a picture. I wish I had a picture that uh I could say uh maybe one side is what one is uh shock observer so that we'll be able to understand but man uh sometimes some of these uh, pictures you find on internet they have copyright so in that case i won't be able to use them otherwise the video will be taken down so all these pictures is that i displayed here uh they are all pictures i took myself you know so uh, i took all these pictures uh even now uh, i've decided uh i'll try as much as possible to be um uh, doing some of these videos with my pictures. In fact, I realized I don't necessarily even need um, I don't need to be doing I, I mustn't be doing like a video like going out, uh, taking videos for me to be able to explain what I needed to explain. No. Because um, there are sometimes I will have something I want to talk, say or is, you know explain. But because I don't have the video or the vehicle, I needed to use that to to describe what I needed to say. And maybe I, what I mean, I don't have means the video at the car at the moment is not with me. So it means until I gain access to use such vehicle to describe or whenever I need, I need to repair the vehicle or something like that. But all I need to do is pictures. 
I need to describe for you to know what I'm talking about. Picture, it doesn't really necessarily need for me to use the camera. I'll be showing it on the base. Is it important? I just, I also have the pictures. I will show you this is what I'm talking about. Oh, so, 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 uh, when you come to this point, this is where you put the, the, this is what will cause this kind of symptom. If, if, uh, you start experiencing the symptom, this is do this one, this will break in this time. You know, that's sort of thing. So, it will make it much faster and, um, Easier for me too because once you go out there and take two videos, it takes a while, some days, sometimes days to start to edit. By edit, I mean you have to plug in and start to resize. It takes a lot to publish all some of these videos. You can see me too. Certainly, some of these videos I do as a pairs and others. Sometimes when I take this video, it takes days, or even not more than a week, before I'll be able to publish it. Okay, so um, now you know. So going forward now, I will try my best. In fact, I'm getting used to it to the point that I hardly even remember to uh, to use thought when I'm, I'm speaking. It's only when I'm preparing uh, like an article or post ahead uh, because it's not flowing. I actually know what they are and I have to put. Sometimes I'll see mistakenly, you know, miss them up. So I'll do my best for, to be able to uh, differentiate the two. You know, so this is taught. This is so. What I might do is, um, anytime I have the chance to snap the two, so I probably will not edit the picture and write taught beside this one, damper or chuck as over beside this one. Basically, they are, uh, yeah, they are dampers, you know, but my point at least one is chuck as over, one is taught. Unless you know this smart and everything, you not say, okay, uh, this is short, this is, uh, you know, then we complete it, because that. So, um, I think that should be it for now. Um, I just didn't have the best picture to, to describe. One picture would have been enough, honestly, to do this video. All I need to have one, uh, have a start, then chuck us over here. That's all. But hey, I have to do with what I have. Um, so, um, like I said, um, I will do my best in terms of uh, the video. Um, I, I, I used to have, uh, what's it called, this external hard drive. All the pictures I've been taking concerning cars, all these things, I've been storing them for years until it crashed. So because of that now, you know, I, I can't. First, I only keep pictures uh, as much as you could, you know. So I may end up sourcing for another hard drive. But if I have my way, I'll get to so that if anything happens to one, uh, I'll say I have another one to back it up, you know. So it make it easier for me. Honestly, it's it's much easier these days for me to use pictures to describe. So that even non pojo cars, I, I don't necessarily have to go for. Non Pojo to take pictures, do capture video with the vehicle to be able to explain what I need to explain. Pictures will be enough. Uh, I will still be using taking pictures from internet, but I will minimize it to avoid copyright uh, issues. Otherwise, you people will be able to get that information. Alright, so the next video.